what's up so welcome back to my channel i'm here with another video today and today i'm just going to be doing an updated nail room tour i figure since we're all quarantining and nothing much is happening i decided to go ahead and show you all what my nail space is looking like um if you haven't had the chance so you can go ahead and take a look at my old nail desk tour and see how much things have improved and also i'm in a different space so i just want to show you that as well so we're going to go ahead and start over here to my cart that has been with me for forever and it's starting to lean but that's okay we still gonna put it to use so up top here we just have some tips on display um my speaker there and my little kit there that i used to make my press ons with some candy uh, my nail prices that need to be typed up and then all of these drawers here just contain empty containers soak off dishes just random jars and old swatch sticks and nothing exciting we got some pedicure products there bunch of random acrylics press ones and some of my gel and you know paints and things of that nature and it's cute little picture up here super cute and we will start over here so here is one of my racks and it that just contains all of my um gel polishes and then this one over here contains all of my regular nail polishes for doing like you know pedicures or whatever and i guess we'll start over here so from the bottom i just have my acetone brush cleaners all of my barbicides and my monomer my paper towels my extra gloves down there my kleenex and on the second row here i just have this little clear container which has all of my glamming glitz glitters custom acrylics more custom acrylics and all of my extra brushes I just got some extra scissors some extra brushes there um, let's see we have some nail dryer my IBD Intensile top coat refill, cuticle oil, nail polish thinner, and then some minor that I used to practice with. And then in this little cubby here, I just have my Young Nails Clear. Um, we have some glitter bells, monomer, Valentino monomer, more monomer here, acetone, nail polish remover this nail glue dryer which is life y'all need to get y'all some and then i have my alcohol back here and some oil and then over here i just have some again more random um, acrylics all of my nice clean towels ready for services and then this is my little um furry thing that i got to take pictures now let's move on to my desk area and let me show y'all what I have on this little thing. This is my little makeup um, organizer, but it works great for my nail products because I can just spin it around and grab whatever I need. So we just have some top coat, dappin dishes, ridge fillers, all of my bling adhesive, my um, protein bond. I keep some little band-aids up here. Gotta have those and some liquid septic. Another dappin dish. My young nails monomer, some blue. On this little row here, we just got um like blooming gels, a uh, couple regular top coats up here. And then over here is all of my gel top coats, all of my preps and primers, my little brushes I use to dust off the nails. And then we got more monomers over here, some brush cleaner and some alcohol. This one contains all of my um, um, cuticle oils and cuticle softeners. This is so cute. I don't think I ever use it. I just like the way it looks. Wasting money, I know. 
And so I have this little jar here which you put your brush cleaner in and um, you put your brushes in here to clean it, to clean them. That's what it looks like. You just stick the brush in there. All right, and then I just have some nail polish remover, some nail surface cleanser back there. I have some lotion and my antibacterial cleaning spray. And then I just have some of my brushes that I use all the time. So <clears throat> my two favorite acrylic brushes, three art brush, a couple striping brushes, my X-Acto knife, and then a practice file there. And I believe that is it for this little cart. And then these two cute, it's my little, I charge my um, camera battery in. But this little container here just has some cotton balls. And this one has the length free wipes. Y'all see my little jar of candy, my little um, card holder there. And then on my desk, I just keep this little mat right here just to catch some of the dust because I just had to change these out because they were so yellow and filthy. So I try to keep that on there so I can keep it looking nice for as long as possible. All right, so let's move over here to this drawer right here. So this one just contains all of my nudes, my clears, my whites, um, and you can see I use my Valentino's and my Young Nails the most. We got some Not Polish, a couple Glam and Glitz. This little kit from Glitter Bells that I, I haven't used yet. Uh, I think we got like some Neil Secret back there and some other brands. And then some custom powders that I made myself. And this drawer right here just contains all of my bling. So this little one... The first one, I just have like regular rhinestones for like little girls or for practicing. Except for these, these are my Swarovski's um, Crystal Pixies. And then these are also some regular rhinestones. I keep my wax pencil right there. We have some black rhinestones and some pearls. And then these are just some chain. I don't know if y'all can see. It's for doing like junk nails or whatever. And then I keep all my little swatches here. For all my acrylics. And then right here are all my Swarovski stones. So we have like the shape ones here. And then we have some colored ones here. And then we just have a bunch of um, get this out. 3D charms in this one. Okay. And then that bottom one right there, that just has like my packaging and all that. Nothing fun. All right, so now over here, I just have my um, Barberside jar, of course, paper towels, UV LED lamp, my little book that I use to write my appointments in. And then up here, I just have my clean implements here that's already been sanitized and everything. This is my personal stuff. I keep my clean dapping dishes over here. And we got like a manicure brush, scissors, um, cuticle nippers, some tweezers down there, a nail piercer, straight edge clippers, a little stir, and I have all my drill bits. And then I have my sanding bands and cotton balls, cotton wipes, and we have the little sponges back there. And in this one right here, I just have all of my um, nail files and buffers. They're all clean, and I keep some of these little sticks so I can just use them and throw them away. I really like using these. It just kind of cuts back on having to clean so much stuff. So let's see here. These are all my other tips that I use. And 
tips. And this bottom one here just contains my foot soaks, my gloves, my armrests, and all of my cleaning supplies. Moving on over here to this little drawer. I have all my other like wax pencils, all my other striping tape, um, not striping tapes, all my other sh like striping brushes, liner brushes, all my other acrylic brushes. This the ones I don't use all the time. All my cleanup brushes, nail cutters, which I don't use at all, and some nippers that I use to remove stones. And then I have my little practice hand, a little flower my daughter made for me. These cute flowers here, my Wi-Fi code, and this little thing right here has these little rocks in here. And you could just plug it in right here. And these turns, um, different colors and then it's like a fan in there you can put some um scent on this little part here and it's supposed to you know blow the scent around i guess but i haven't used it yet all right so in this little thing here i just have a bunch of random tips like practice tips um cheap tips that i find wherever amazon sally's a bunch of different tips and then of course my nail um, forms these are my favorite ones down here so yeah, just a bunch of tips down there and then let's start from the top here so this is where I have all of my colored acrylics at second one contains all of my nail foils I have a little stamping kit I have a book back there that has a bunch of foils and angel paper in it and this is just a bunch of nail stickers water depots um, that sort of thing there's a bunch in here and this drawer has a lot of glitter in it I like um, butterflies flowers, different types of shapes and colors of glitters, and this one just has more glitter. I tried to organize this one by colors. This is all I came up with. Yeah. Alright, and so in this drawer here, we have all of our chromes and chameleon flakes, striping tape, uh, leaf foils, a bunch of 3D nail art in the back, some caviar beads, my Sharpie markers, a bunch of these little um, wheels here with stuff in them. We got Fimo, more flowers and nail art, more nail chain. And we got a lot of these little alcohol inks. And then in this drawer, we just have buffers, nail files, or sticks. So. And then last but not least is this drawer here, which contains all of my face masks, um, my antibacterial cleansing spray. I got some cuticle oils down here. We got some fast oils down here. More, um... Cotton wipes, all of my little swatch sticks, my fine sanding van, these are my coarse sanding van. We got some extra top coat, alcohol prep wipes, some, I don't know, I said glue, and then my um, protein bomb. And then we also have some little manicure sticks back there too. Alright, so that's it, y'all. Oh, and back here is where I keep like my dirty implements. I try to hide them. Nobody want to see that. All right, so that is it. Let me just give y'all like a little pan around of everything. This is my seat in here, and it opens up, and inside of there, I just have a bunch of my like um, ring lights and tripods, camera stand, all that extra crap. It just look too tacky, so. This is what it looks like in here. And 
hope you all enjoyed this tour. All right, so until next time, guys, thank you all for watching. Bye.